They say a picture's worth a thousand words, and, and we're, we're very big fans of pictures. We find them to be very effective in, in identifying notable activity, notable transactions. Um, and we think that it helps auditors to really see things that, that may have been harder to see in a tabular format or some other data uh, file format. So this is a very simple visualization. It's same store sales uh, for you know, half a dozen stores, looking at last year in the first row, this year in the second row, et cetera. And you can see that all the stores are showing a decline year over year, except for this bottom store in Westbury. And uh, this store managed to show a year over year increase by year end, and conveniently by June 30th. So this is the kind of thing that you might want to understand uh, as an auditor, and we, and we drilled, drilled through uh, to understand this fact pattern. All of these are, are, are real, real stories. The numbers have been changed to protect the innocent, but uh, these are real audits. This may look like Hurricane Harvey. This is actually a, a 2016 analysis we did of uh, 2015 wind damage claims from another hurricane. Uh, just like I was saying before, uh, in terms of seeing uh, unique or notable items in a picture, we see wind damage claims uh, concentrated in the north and uh, tapering off down to the south, and then we see a big pocket, and then we see wind damage claims down here in Brownsville. So a little suspicious to see wind damage claims there, but not for 100 miles north of there. So what turned out was happening here was there was flooding damage in Brownsville, but that wasn't covered by insurance. So homeowners were filing these claims under wind damage claims. This is a map of heating degree days that we use to better understand revenue for a propane uh, a retailer. Uh, we actually did a, a regression analysis, which, which some would consider old-fashioned. Regression's been around for a while. But uh, we did predict effectively the, the, the propane sales based on the heating degree days and got a really good plot of that, with the exception of this circled item, which was notable revenue relative to what the regression would have anticipated. Well, Brian, you know, those, uh, those are really interesting images and really help us think about quality, but those images also allow us to talk with our clients. Think about the insights that we can share with our clients when we take their data and explain it to them in a different way. And that, that's really powerful stuff.